Thanks for watching this realhomerecording.com video. You can get monthly audio engineering news and exclusive videos by signing up for our newsletter. Hello Internet. I'm here today with Matt Ward from Elk OS. I did a video about this a couple months ago and I'm going to have Matt explain it because he's way better than I am at talking about this new service slash product slash awesomeness. <laughs> Thanks, Adam. Uh, first of all, the name of the product is the Elk Music OS. The name of the company that makes it that I work for is uh, Mind Music Labs. I'm the senior vice president of partnerships and strategy. Um, I have a long history in the in the professional audio industry, including working for companies like Universal Audio, uh, Plugin Alliance, Studer Revox, Otari, uh, Emu Systems, um, and uh, what. Elk is is an operating system that allows hardware manufacturers, whether they're going to make synthesizers or drum machines or uh, audio interfaces or live effects processors or even something like a digital mixing console, it allows them to run plugins that exist, VST or rack extension plugins that exist out in the world now in very, very low latency on general purpose processors like Intel uh, Atoms or ARM uh, processors, which is, is the very significant part of what we're doing. Yeah, when I saw some of the NAM videos that were coming out, I mm -hmm. was just like, wow. And mm -hmm. this, this to me is something that we... Especially with, you know, like, because VS, a lot of VSTs are free or they are low cost um, compared to, I'm not going to name the other brands, but people know what I'm talking, what I'm referring to. And this to me is, you know, the way of, I don't want to say the way of the future, but this is something that those platforms, you know, like you said, rack extensions and VST have been missing Um ultra low latency, reliability, uh, portability. And I mean, just this operating system opens up so many new ways of using current software. And, and that's what really got me excited. Well, I think the, the, um, what VST plugins and rack extension plugins are designed to do is to work inside of a DAW, inside of a computer in a desktop recording environment. And they do that really, really well. And that's been a, a, a thriving uh, ecosystem for, you know, more than a decade now with with uh, really two decades. I mean, Wave started doing this, you know, more than 20 years ago um, with these incredible amount of, of processors and instruments and things. But they've all been designed to use in the computer. And um, previously in the recording environment, if you wanted to have low latency monitoring of uh, effects in the recording environment, you had to buy a Pro Tools HD system. So when I was at Universal Audio and we developed the Apollo line of interfaces, what was so significant about that product line was that it, for the first time, brought that capability of having very low latency effects and potentially instruments in a desktop recording environment using these uh, uh, VST developed um, uh, products. But even at that time, um, and I can remember, you know, viewing some, uh, some company taking uh, the ability to, to deliver those low latency effects in a recording or a stage environment and doing it with off the shelf processors like ARMS and uh, Intel uh, style 80, x86 processors, um, as a long-term competitive threat because of the incredible power uh, advantage that those general purpose processors have over the dedicated DSP chips that a system like the Apollo or all the, or the, the um, HD, uh, Pro Tools HD uses, um, or HDX, I guess now. Um, so that's what got me so excited about getting involved with, with my music labs. When I understood what Elk was when I first talked to Mikhail Benincasa, who's the founder and CEO of uh, of Mind Music Labs. I instantly got what this was was about, and instantly saw this this enormous um, uh, potential. Um, and so that's what kind of got me out of the bullpen. I was, you know, riding my bicycle and thinking about writing my book and doing something other than uh, than pro audio. And now I'm I'm back in the game with both feet because uh, uh, because what I think uh, Elk and what Mind Music Labs are doing are so is so exciting. 